trying to get a recording of this before the battery dies, but it actually spins so fast it's hard to get a video of it. But you can see how it's spinning. It's, there's not even a swivel on it at this point. All I did was took a Dr. Pepper can, and uh, I'll show you the video. Okay, the can itself, all I did was I cut vertical slices in it, roughly equal distances apart. So it went all the way around, and then I cut the little slits to make little flaps. I actually just used a relatively dull X-Acto knife while wearing a glove on my other hand. Actually, I wasn't, but I will pretend I was. Um, but then when I bent the parts out, I started doing it without a glove, and then I put a glove on just so I wouldn't, you know, before I cut myself. Anyway. So, and that's all it is. And actually, I drilled a hole in the bottom to put a thread through, and then I just said, nah, I'll just fold up the little tab. So I just folded up the tab and uh, put it on there. There's not even a swivel, so at this point. So, but, I mean, for something like this, I wouldn't recommend, maybe, well, you could take half a can and stick it to the bottom, some bottom of something, or something equivalent. You know, anything with radial blades like that. I'll show you one more time how fast it spins, even with the thread all twisted up. It's, it's slightly breezy out here right now, but yeah, you can see it obviously spins pretty well. Whee! It's just getting tighter on my finger. Okay, we'll see you later.